It is perhaps a most unlikely image of the farm of the future, but take a closer look inside this stark and sterile former warehouse and there are tiny signs of life. The seeds of the world's most technologically advanced vertical farm about to bear fruit. So this is a massive leap from traditional agriculture. The team here take every precaution to keep the farm as sterile as possible. It's the brainchild of Dr. Paul Challoner, whose first harvest will happen next week. The pink light creating the ideal conditions for the plants to grow at almost twice the normal speed. We're going to be harvesting next week, literally. We've got LED lighting, um, so we're concentrating on red and blue light, but we've also put a fraction of white light in there to enable us to look at the plants in situ so we can monitor how they're growing. This uh, is a very energy efficient uh, light source and it has very specific uh, wavelengths uh, which are red and blue uh, which are uh, ideal for growing crops. Uh, it's uh, affected 365 days of the year and uh, is very consistent as well so you get consistent crop growth. These crops are grown using a technique known as hydroponics. It means rather than growing in soil, the roots of these parsley plants sit in a solution of water and essential nutrients. It means instead of needing swathes of farmland, they can be stacked and grown on shelves up to 40 feet high. We can produce crops right through the year to match any demand that there might be. So we're less reliant on imports uh, and we can have that consistent quality any time of the year. So potentially there is an implication for this kind of technology post-Brexit? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, the timing's very good. Um, we just want to um, offer this system out because it's modular and scalable and will fit into um, uh, required production wherever that may, might be in the country. Almost the entire process is automated, most of the work carried out by a robot called Frank. The novelty is not lost on Frank's human colleagues who helped to build this futuristic farm in the first place. Uh, once it was all finished, I was amazed. Yeah, I was amazed because I never, I was never really inside doing all the building work. I was mainly outside, so actually being able to come in and see it all lit up and everything, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, not like sci-fi movie. <laughs> of course, this is science fact, a glimpse of the future of farming in a small corner of North Lincolnshire. Michael Billington, ITV News in Scunthorpe.